The fleet of Aruna is decimated in its final attempt to break the Creonite supply chain. Now Karenna summons her deepest powers and conjures a magical vision of her brother Elson on his dangerous quest in the caverns of Bis. In this revelation, she sees her only hope lies in joining forces with Elson in Creon to strike a magical death blow to the very heart of their common enemy. She issues a farewell decree to her people. Beloved children of Varuna, I have only one hope. I must combine my power with that of my brother Elson. Lear grants that we break the grip of this metal fist before it crushes us all. I go now to find a break in this wall of iron that surrounds me. From there, I will find my way to Elson and seek a shining hope for us all. Karenna, Mage Queen of Varuna. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to Let's Play the Iron Plague. I'm your host, Nerus, and this is Chapter 18, Shining Hope. I don't like this mission. Varuna's fleet is being destroyed. Well, of course it is. It's, face it's facing Creon ships, and Creon ships, as we have seen, are amazing and make Varuna ships look like shit. So, we've got Karenna's veteran guard to the west. We need to get Karenna and her veteran guard to the waterway in the east, and if any of them die, we're fucked. Now I apologize in advance for the pausing that's going to occur in this mission, but a whole bunch of shit happens all at the start, and I kind of need to get everything together. And as you can see, what we've got here is we have Karenna and a couple of Priests of Lear, and we're going to try and want to keep all of those. And we have a bunch of Creon ships. Not super great. And we have a bunch of our own ships, as well as a bunch of various defensive structures scattered about. And what we're going to do is we're going to take all our ships and we're going to build them up into a great big blob, and we're basically just going to sacrifice this entire chunk of the map. Because as you can see, we've got lodestones built and light towers built around the place. We can't defend any of this. Creon are just going to march across like they have a bunch of dudes just all along the eastern edge of this map and they're just going to kill us all. There's nothing we can do. So what we're going to do instead is consolidate. All of these lodestones will provide us with mana for a while until they get destroyed. So as such we have an opportunity to very well, very well. do stuff. And up here we have Karina's Veteran Guard, and you can tell that they're Karina's Veteran Guard because they're all gold ranked. You can see, yeah. You can sort of look down here, yeah. It's all gold. Every one of these guys is gold, including the Priest Salir and the Priestesses. These are the only gold Priestesses you will ever see because priestesses cannot get kills and thus cannot get veterancy levels. As you can see, they do not even have like little gold thingos added to them. Actually, none of these guys have... That's weird. I don't know why any of these guys have gold things and, like they should have gold weapons and stuff. I mean, I know I'm quite certain that the crusaders at least get gold shields and gold armor. Hmm. Weird. I don't know why that's happened. Anyway, I apologize in advance for the uh, pausing that's going to occur here, because a lot of stuff happens. I think I've already apologized for that. I apologize for apologizing. Ah, there you go. Oh look, there we go, they've gained their gold things. Crusaders again look gold pauldrons. And they've gained gold helmets. Hmm, interesting. I guess the gold stuff doesn't appear until later. Oop, come here. Now, as you can see with our Priest of Lear, if we wanted to, we could build a sea dragon! The sea dragon is Varuna's gold dragon. It's their ancient dragon. Everyone gets an ancient dragon. I'm pretty sure I've talked about this. You have a need. I'm not going to build one, because... Why? It, it doesn't contribute anything of use. Instead, I'm going to build some lighthouses. 
Okay, why are these guys not going down here? Come on. Come on. Okay, no, what what is this? What's what is this? Come on, I'm telling why are they not sailing away? Come on. Do I just not have control over these guys? Is that what this is? What the hell, kingdoms? What the hell? Wow. I... I literally cannot control these these boats. This boat will not obey my commands. That's absurd. Utterly absurd. Alright, whatever. Mer warriors and parrots. I need parrots. Give me parrots. Actually, before I get parrots, I need some replacement priestesses. Because what I'm basically going to do is load all my priestesses up. All of the uh, Karenna's elite guard up into a single thing. Transport ship. Come here, transport ship. And then we're just going to protect the single transport ship because it's a hell of a lot easier than protecting all of these guys. Fortunately, these two priests of Lear who are with Karenna are not part of her elite guard for reasons. And here we can see some of the Creon forces that show up. Dragons are no fun. I think, uh, I think you can obey my move orders now, yet. No, no, that man of war is doing its own thing. Just to passive and tell it to stop. No, no, I can't. Yeah, that man of war is just straight up not in my control. Awesome. So we need to sort of crush all the Creon dudes and then charge through. Uh -huh. I don't really understand what we're, what the game expects of us here. Oh well, let's uh, see if we can figure it out. Oh, hello, we've got incoming ironclads. Now a bunch of these guys who are incoming are carrying troops, so we want to kill them so they don't get to do a land assault on us. Yeah, that's what we're talking about. Dead ironclad's a good ironclad. And parrots. One more parrot. That is sufficient parrot. I will not fail. No, you 
going to blister. Well, you might expect. Okay then. Excellent. Get a nice mix of men of war and harpoon ships from here. And there's some of the land assaults. Bunch of dudes, but there's not a whole lot we can do about that just yet, so we won't. Priestelier, there you are. If you wander down there. Stones. Well, there you go. Take out the ironclad. I think keeping the uh, Creon land invasion forces are in check are pretty important in this mission. And my blisters are all stuck on each other. Because ballistas. Good work, ballistas. Come on. I will not fail. Really? I will not fail. Oh, okay. Just command. sit there and shoot things. I'm sure you'll do something useful at some point eventually. I hope. Why am I building a trebuchet ship? Stop that. Alright, let's see if we can keep down some of the Creonites a bit. Give some offshore bombardment. I'm actually surprised at the lack of Neo Dragons. I was expecting more. More attacked me in my test runs. Hmm. Well, there you go. I do not have the income to just do Men of War forever. Well then, let's clear this island. Aye, 
serve humbly. Prismatic mirror, gotta get that killed. Don't want no prismatic mirrors. Hey, that's what we're talking about. Yeah, much better. somewhere. Shit. Yeah, that's out of range. Hold back, guys. Mm-hmm. 
this is going much better than I expected, actually. And let's get some more warriors. thing about Mer Warriors is they build quick. It's actually one of the nice things about a lot of DLC units, because the Mer Warrior is one of those. Most of the DLC units actually build fairly quickly, which is pretty good. That said, there are exceptions. Because of course there are. When has there ever ne not been exceptions? I'm not 100% sure if I have the forces necessary to uh, complete this mission, but hey, let's give it a shot. In theory, if I get this transport ship over here, I think I just win outright. This is a pretty hefty force. And it's been 20 minutes, so you know, I've built up a reasonable armada here. Let's, uh, let's see if it works. And if not, then, well, I should have a pretty big blob of my warriors by the time I'm finished, and those will no doubt be able to do something. And of course, being able to attack Creon before they can reinforce with those bullshit prismatic fucking mirrors. Big importance. Kill that prismatic mirror. Kill it, kill it, kill it, kill it. Kill it. I didn't wait much longer for this. This looks a lot like Freon have uh, rebuilt orders to build prismatic mirrors in certain locations, and that is just hideous. And uh, it's terrifying. I do not want to deal with that at all. Ugh. See you next time, ladies and gentlemen.